We spent time doing military training two weeks ahead of time, and it really helped because the uh, the, the mannerisms, how you move with, with the pistol and what you're doing at different points and how to run all through the woods, all kind of stuff. And it was a different environment. It's just brought off onto the city streets now. And then you see the same tactics. Like when we, when instead of just, we're able to lay down really strong fire and peel back at the same time. So to move further away from, you know, the, uh, the target while firing and stuff like that. And it, those, all those different things, we, we went over it with training. We had a, a good coordinator. I don't know how, what you can compare it to. I, don't even, I haven't even seen anything on TV like that, like that in film that, that was that intense in that kind of setting. You know, like, because it's still, it's cars all over the people. <laughs> it's madness. Like, it's just, they're getting out of the cars and running and all that kind of stuff. You got to imagine being in a traffic jam and a full-blown shootout starts taking place. Hi there, I hope you liked the video. Did you notice any behind the scenes action? Stuntmen and women have been around for a long time, stepping in for various scenes. Now, the first Hollywood stuntman was ex-US cavalryman Frank Hannaway, who was cast in The Great Train Robbery from 1903 for his ability to fall off a horse without hurting himself. The first Hollywood stunt woman was Helen Gibson, who doubled for Helen Holmes in the first 26 episodes of The Hazards of Helen from 1914. She was trained as a trick rider and married to cowboy star Hoot Gibson. Ooh. Who would you like to have as your stunt double? Let me know in the comments below. For me, Megan, Megan Fox. The same, twins. Uh, remember, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. Bye-bye.